good morning hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna be doing a vlog i guess you could say like come along with me type of video because today is a very special and important day in my life i am getting eye corrective surgery i don't want to say lasik because i'm not getting the lasik version i'm getting smile that's another type of procedure it's basically like you know they're still using a laser i guess to correct my vision i am super excited but i'm also a little bit nervous because i have never had surgery before in any type of form like i've always been relatively healthy and stuff when i do get sick has been treatable through like medication or topical treatments and stuff like that the fact that a laser is going to be in my eyeballs in less than an hour is very scary and i just am leaving everything in god's hands in source's hands i'm hoping god will bless me with some beautiful vision afterwards because i am so tired of wearing glasses and contacts i cannot stand them anymore it is a currently 8 21 i should be leaving soon like within the next five minutes but first i wanted to finish putting more antibiotic eye drops in my eyes I got these from the doctor. He told me to put these in the night before and then the day of, like in the morning, before I came in. So I'm just going to put these in my eyes. These eye drops do sting a little bit. Like, it's not that bad. Like, I've definitely had sting in my eyes worse. It's so weird because last night I put them in and then I was laying down in my bed, like, going to sleep. And I could literally taste the fucking eye drops in my mouth. I was like, it must have went through, like, my sinuses and stuff. I don't know how it got in my mouth, but I definitely could taste it, so... I'll let you guys know if I can taste it again. Okay, so my mom's gonna be taking me. Mom, I'm vlogging. Oh my gosh. Don't crush my dreams. Do you guys have those families too? They don't like being on camera. When do you wanna go? When you are ready. I'm ready. I'm going like this. They said to dress comfortable because the... Oh my God, I tasted it in my mouth. The eye drops. It's crazy and i'm eating a cookie which is kind of weird they said to dress comfortable because the operating room is really cold if you guys have a lucky's near you it's a grocery store they have them in california these cookies are so good they're freshly made oh they're fire but my mother had corrective surgery before i was born a few years before i was born she said she had worse eyesight than i did i don't know if i believe that because these lenses are the kind where they like make them thinner so that they don't look so thick and i'm thinking just back when she had glasses still i'm all making her sound old <laughs> they didn't have that technology to thin out your lenses <laughs> yes they did <laughs> they were still thick though she had really good eyesight afterwards like she didn't need glasses or anything until the past few years and the only thing she needs is like reading glasses so i'm excited Hopefully, mine goes good too. I'll just see you guys when I get there. We are waiting here for the surgeon to come examine my eyes and then he will take me into the operating room. The doctor, when we were in the waiting room still, he gave me um, a medicine and it's Valium, and I think it's for anxiety. And then me and my mom were making a joke right now, like, well, I'm gonna need these to go because I always have anxiety. So if I feel better in about 20 minutes, y'all know why. The surgeon, surgeon, right? Yeah. He just came in and gave me my eye exam to make sure everything was gonna go smooth and he said that it also helps program the laser like that's gonna do my eyes to what did you say yeah. to see better like it kind of pinpoints where i need to have corrections but that was very stressful because i don't know if i'm just tired or i couldn't focus but the letters were like Kind of hard to see hopefully he brings me in there soon i'm really hungry and i want coffee so hopefully my mom will be kind and take me to get a tamale after hopefully they're still there or to the panderia yeah I get it. i'll buy you a coffee they're going to program the laser right now and then he'll take me in there okay let's put some coffee in the ice here okay 
so great. Just... You done? Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, this is cover your head. Oh, what? Uh, this is cover your head. Put it on your head. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm supposed to keep my eyes closed. Right? You can open them. Oh. And then when you open them. Oh my goodness. Put on your feet. Thank you. 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 Yeah, I've seen it. <laughs> Open please. Let me put some chocolate on the screen, please. She's in good job. Up, okay? Good job. Sit up. Thank you. Be careful this step. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. You can see already? Can you see already? Hi guys, so I just got back in my car. Um, they just let me out of the like the surgery room. They just took me to the front and I took some Tylenol and now we're in the car. I feel really tired. I was so scared, honestly. I started like feeling like like crying. When I was there, I was like panicking a little bit because the machine gets so close to your eye that I just felt like I was like suffocating a little bit, like claustrophobic. They said it went well. 
I could see a little bit, like, it's still not, like, that great. But I'm hoping, like, once I go to sleep, because I have to go to sleep when I get home, that I'll be fine when I wake up. And hopefully I'll have great vision. How do you feel, Mom? I'm glad it's over. And got it all on video. And hope every, everything goes well. Yeah. The surgeon was nice. And then he recorded all. Yeah, he like talked me through everything. Basically what they did was they put numbing eye drops in like more. He told me to look at him so I had to look up because he was behind me. And then they put the clamp in to keep my eye open. And then they centered the laser and I had to stare at the green light. That was like 20 seconds, 26 seconds because I heard the lady counting, counting down. She would say like 26, 25, 24, all the way to one. And then I don't know if they moved the laser or the laser moved itself, but they kind of like moved it away. And then he like took something, some type of tool and was like, I'm gonna mess with the tissue in your eye. And so he was like moving it around and I could not see anything. Imagine like a dark gloomy day and all you see is like a little bit of light. Like it was almost black and, but I could still see the light. I can like see it kind of moving like it was weird. What would I describe it like? Jelly kind of? Like it looks like 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 little jelly is moving or something. Like you can kind of see the them moving it around. Then it was over. Um, my eyes are a little sensitive right now. Like I kind of feel like pressure on them. But I think that's normal. My eyes should be closed right now because I'm in the car but they're open. Yeah, I'm just gonna have my mom take me Starbucks or something, Mom. No, you need to go to sleep. No, I want Starbucks. No, you need to go to sleep. Mm -hmm. Oh, can you at least give me a freaking thumbnail? Well, how about I let you go home and, and go to sleep and then I'll go get you the thumbnail. They're gonna be gone by the time you get there. Probably gone if they didn't slip. So don't, don't lie to me then. Well, I can go get you some, but I don't know if they're gonna be from the same place that you wanted to. Okay, can you make me hot chocolate at least when we get home? Yes. <laughs> I was trying to think of a word, but <laughs> I'm always dramatic. Guess I'll update you guys when I get home or whenever I check in because I'm supposed to go to sleep when I get home. Hi guys. It's so nice to see you. Oh my god. Okay, so I don't know when I exactly left off in the last clip. I can't remember because I fell asleep. And it is now 5.18. I probably got home around noon. You know, I had to fall asleep uh, per the doctor's instructions. So, look at my cat wants to use the little handle that's on my camera. He's been like so obsessed with like, like dangly things. I don't know what <laughs> his problem is. Halloween. What is it, mama? Oh my god, she wants to hit it because she doesn't know what it is. Look at her. <laughs> I'm not trying to scare her. What is it, mama? See, you're okay. <laughs> I don't know what's tripping them out about the camera, but that was hilarious. But um, yeah, I came home. I went to sleep. I put the goggles that they gave me on. This is not smart to do with one hand. Okay, this is <laughs> this is what they look like, and they didn't slip off. I didn't tighten them or anything. I just literally threw them on. But they they weren't uncomfortable or anything, you know, I fall asleep with my glasses all the time. So um, I think I'm just used to it, so it wasn't bad for me or anything. I just put more of the antibiotic eye drops in my eyes because they said once I wake up from my nap to put them in again. And then I believe I'm supposed to put them in every four hours. And then starting tomorrow until my post-op appointment, which is in a week, I will put them in four times a day.
it is so crazy because i can literally see like I, it's not the most crisp vision ever i don't think because you know they're it's so fresh that it's just healing but i can fucking see bro like i can see my phone i can see my freaking cats i can read a message on my phone without having to put my phone like right here and um it's just so crazy because i keep like testing myself like i'll like look at something in my room and i'll look at it and i'll be like can i really see that and i'm like wow i can really fucking see that i am so excited and happy that i can see already because i do know that some people they have really blurry vision and cannot drive like next day but i think i'm ready to go back to work tomorrow i can see guys like i can literally see myself in the viewfinder right now it's so crazy because i literally was the blindest bitch like i cannot see shit i'm very happy right now with how my eyes are seeming to have already adapted yeah i think it's only just gonna get better it's gonna get more and more crisp so if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel and also let me know down in the comments if you have any questions and i will be sure to check the comments and get back to you